on this episode of Woodchuck's Garage. Here we go again with my Ford Mustang, the EcoBoost S550 with this miserable S550 six-speed. The uh, shifter handle has walked up once again. This will be number three. My fingers don't work very well. So uh, let's go through the process of putting it back on again. So here's the shifter. All I gotta do is pull up on it, smash my mirror, and it's out again. We've done this before. It's just one set screw. That's just a, a composite, I think, body mounted base on it. When we're gonna put this back on using a screwdriver and a hammer. So I got started. We're going to try and shove it down the best we can. Then we're going to grab the hammer. I can't believe I'm doing this. And we're going to keep going until it seats in there. Then we'll set the screw and uh, tighten it down. Hopefully it stays put for, I don't know, a few days. Keep hammering until the sound of the thuds stop sounding hollow and it sounds more dense. Then look at it and make sure it's down as far as it'll go and maybe it three more times just because you want to. We'll go ahead and tighten up that set screw and try it out. All right, set screw is tightened down. I won't go no further. I can only go so far. Bear in mind, this bezel is kind of a pain in the butt. You will start to wrinkle the chrome after you take it on and off a few times. No, the Nomar trim tools do not help. I did see another poster do that and break the chrome right off of it. All it has on the bottom is just these tabs. And it likes to separate here, right on the edge. So you got to sometimes squeeze it back together. But you can already see that, that chrome starting to flake. Not such a great design throughout, but you're going to have to deal with it. So I got her smacked down, got her tightened down. All I got to do is snap this back down. Just like that. You can adjust your little boot or how you want it. It also appears shorter in the console. So if your Mustang feels like the shifter's getting real wonky or weak, uh, it's most likely because this is growing. It's going right up off that base shaft on the, the lower mount. So once you get this beat back down tighten down you'll notice a big improvement in the shifting quality although it wasn't that great to begin with hey thanks for watching woodchuck's garage